This next slide takes us to this passage, and this is what I want to emphasize with you. And it's right over here. It says in Jeremiah 15, 16, the most beautiful application for us of this name. Now remember, this whole class is in Isaiah. We're looking at the incarnation and at the glorious, powerful names that Jesus, you know, his name, the name that's above every name, the name of Jesus, but his names in the wonderful counselor, mighty God, everlasting father. And what does Jeremiah 15, 16 say? One of my favorites, I'll quote it to you. Thy words were found and I did eat them. And thy word was for me the joy and rejoicing of my heart because I'm called by your name, O Lord of hosts. You know what would be the best way to apply this lesson about the wonderful counselor and, and how we just looked at Jesus. And by the way, in your notes, uh, all of you that, that have the class notes, I go all the way through the Gospel of John. In every chapter, Jesus wonderfully counsels someone with their most desperate need and lovingly, gently helps them. How can we have that in our lives today? Thy words were found. Read the book of Isaiah. As you're doing your devotional journal, in each chapter that you study, find the truths about what he's doing, his plan, his promises, uh, the, the many names, the, the powerful names, the glorious names of our God. Find them and then eat them. In other words, say, Lord, I want you to be my counselor. I want to come to you. Just like I used to run to the guidance counselor in public school, I want to now run to you as my counselor. Back to your slides. The Bible is Christ-centered because at the incarnation, we see Jesus is unlike anyone who has ever lived, who was ever born, and who ever died. Jesus came to be God with us.